there you are. Good day and welcome. My name is Andy and I'll be your tour guide today for atlionfarms.com at Lion Safari. Today we're going to be looking for lions, not big yellow furry lions out in the safari somewhere. We're talking about little tiny ant lions that usually can be found in little dry sanding areas. But lucky for us, we're here at atlionfarm.com breeding compound. So we'll be able to find them real easy. So come on, it's going to be a lot of fun. Let's go find some ant lions. Well, just had a quick stop with the compound equipment locker. Pick up a few things. Here we got shovel, bucket, all useful tools for hunting the almighty ant lion. But today we're going to do it like my dear old dad. Nothing but a spoon. This little bitty spoon, we're going to catch us some ant lions. Let's go. Wow, what a great place for breeding ant lions. It's covered from the elements, it's dry and sandy, perfect place for finding ant lions. Now, you're probably wondering, what is an ant lion? Well, an ant lion is part of the zoological classification Miramella, Mira, Melanoma, Mira on the wall, Mimeliontidae family, which is broken down from the Greek word Mirex, which means ant, and Leon, which means lion. Now, you probably want to know, how do you find these ant lions? Well, you got to find a dry sandy area, and then you look for little tiny circle pits in the ground, like this one right here. We've got a whole cluster of ant lion pits, but we got this big bloke right here. He must be a huge one. He's going to be catching some ants real soon. So that's how you find yourself an ant lion. Now this is a cone-shaped pit of an ant lion here in this dry, sandy area, just like I talked about. This is where the ant lion sits and waits for the ants to come along. Now the ant lion is also referred to in North America as the doodle bug, or to some as the familiar. But now, the ant lion makes this little tiny cone-shaped pit to catch its prey, which are Ants, which I call an ant lion. Now, let's see if we can catch one. What we do is take the spoon and we dig about an inch below the surface and bring it up like this. Now, sifting it out in the spoon in your hand, and then we should be able to find the ant lion. Well, here he is the ant lion. Isn't he beautiful? Well, this ant lion is about good average larvae size, measures about 1.5 centimeters. Now to you Yanks, that's about six inches. I mean a sixth of an inch, that's right, a sixth of an inch. Now what he does is, see him trying to move back into the dirt there? He's trying to make himself another pit so he can catch some more ants because he's a hungry little fella. So, in the next segment, we're going to be talking about the ant lion pit and how he catches an ant.